I have a new... <laughs> All right, that wasn't meant to look like that, but does something look funny about this or what? Especially when it's like mega zoomed. <laughs> All right, back to business. Serious business. Guys, I have a new strongest dinosaur. And I also have an enormous broodmother above my head. Excuse me? What are you doing, Titan broodmother? My gosh, I just can't catch a break with these Titans lately. Legit, I think I've chosen like the worst place on the map to live. Anyways, new strongest team. It's not you, not you, not you, or you, not you, you, or you, not you, and not you either, El Tigre. Not you anymore. Not you, uh, actually. Actually, maybe, but unfortunately, I can't ride you to find out, so not you. Nope, no, nope, no, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. <laughs> and obviously not you, buddy. <laughs> uh, where are your shoes, buddy? Come on, man. Common decency around here. It's this guy. Nope, not the Titan behind it. The giant Argentavis directly in front of us. Yesterday was crazy. We evolved our tiny little pygmy Argentavis into this beautiful majestic beast behind us. Our very first prime tame, which so far doesn't really mean much because I haven't, I haven't even jumped on his back yet. I don't even have a saddle for it yet. Oh boy. Oh dear. It just crossed my mind. Do I actually need a special saddle to ride this? Because if I do, I'm, I, oh gosh. I might be unprepared. Okay. It seems that there's only one certain type of RG saddle available to be crafted. So I'm just going to hope that it's that one. Also, I always forget where to actually craft items. This one's crafted on my own inventory, not inside of my smithy. Oh, wait a second. We've actually got like special saddles in here. No, I guess we don't. What are you talking about? I thought surely there'd be like some special version two saddle or something I'd need. Speaking of version two saddles, look at the loot we ended up with yesterday, by the way. Look, tier two, tier two, tier two. We got a whole bunch of tier two saddles here and regular saddles. Anyway, I, I need to like tame some dinosaurs so we can actually get some use out of these things. I also need to switch out some of this armor because we have better options actually not really just one oh and we got this little drone summoning artifact i want to summon that well uh let's let's have a look <laughs> <laughs> That's one of those things that I ran into in the uh, river a couple of days ago. I thought it was dead and then it starts zapping dinosaurs. Yeah, I don't really know much about the drones in this, but it's something we're probably going to possibly look into at some point. But hey, is he generating me resources or does he just come with free resources? Hey, if you generate resources, buddy, I will, I will, I will allow it. I will welcome it, as a matter of fact. Yeah, I might need to do a bit of research on this little dude. Sorry, every time I come to give my dude here a saddle, I keep getting distracted by a giant brood mothers roaming around above my base. <laughs> oh, I didn't even need a saddle. You're gonna, you're gonna drop that surprise on me right now. Do you want a saddle anyways? Because I do have one here. Okay, you can have one anyways. Great. Well, here we go. It's time to test out our very first prime tame. Oh, straight off the bat, you are a speedy little demon. That is what I love to be seeing. Um, How about for damage? How are we looking? Mm, it's not great, but it's not terrible either. About a thousand damage. Okay, yeah, now we got a thousand damage. That's juicy. That's what I was hoping for. Um, awesome. Great. Fantastic. Do we have any secondary abilities? Hold on. Is that that golden dodo? No, that's just a regular unique apex dodo. There was a golden dodo on this beach that we encountered yesterday. Hey, I'll kill the little, the little fella anyways. 21 levels already. So let's have a look at the stats here and see what we're actually doing. We got 12,000 health. We got a bunch of damage. Oh yeah. Secondary abilities. Let's have a look. Can we pick stuff up? Right click. Wait, I can't pick up a carbo or did I just try too early? I, I might just suck at picking stuff up. Yeah, we got ourselves a Parasaur. Not anymore. He dead. We also got this guy. I see you. See you later, Apex Tyranodon. 22 levels. Well, let's start allocating some of these. I think I'm just going to chuck a couple into speed just to get that out of the way. Hello? Somebody just attacked me. Oh, we got little people down here attacking us. Come on, guys. What are we doing? Pull your heads in. We can be friends. I probably should have offered working together before killing them. Hey. All right. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I keep getting distracted. Also, I just realized the dude here is probably as speedy as it is because I am wearing these boots that we got yesterday that increase our dinosaur's speed by 10%. So that's pretty sweet. Anyways, 23 levels. Uh, well, I guess I'm putting another couple into movement speed, but the rest are all going to go into damage. So we can, I don't know, see what that's made of. Now, do I have a C ability? Oh, the minions. I forgot about guys oh from memory yeah i was gonna say these guys are ridiculously strong in fact way stronger than what we are yes oh these guys are little beauties i forgot about the minions 
Oh, now I'm pumped. Now I am pumped. Kill the tracks. Go. Get these ones. Man, these things are stronger than me. Ooh, there's like seven of them. So good. I just don't get experience from killing them. So that's kind of like a little disappointing. But like, is there anything around that could actually give me a whole chunk of experience? Like some giant brontosauruses, perhaps. I don't know. Oh, I'm taking a bit of damage. I mean, not no, no surprise to anybody. Brontosauruses do deal a heavy blow, but that's fantastic. Uh, that's a giant diplo. Oh, we got dragons. And, oh, actually, I got to be careful. That. Oh, yeah, I got to be careful, man. We've seen a few nests around the map. And if we get too close to those, we will be attacked by their protectors, I suppose. Look at this. This little guy. Basically, what I'm saying though is you can't just go roaming around everywhere carefree. You need to kind of work out where you're going. For example, uh, I'm already seeing a few little guys in the distance. We've got an Apex Manticore. I could probably fight that. We've got an, uh, well, it's just a regular RG. We got this guy, Apex Dragon. From memory, these guys are ridiculously strong. If you want to see what I've experienced with these guys in the past, go watch my old series. I had a bad time with these guys. A very bad time. But I wonder if I could get my minions to like target an Apex Manticore, for example. Because if they can take him down, I might be able to sneak in there and steal his egg. And I'm pretty sure on yesterday's adventure, we actually got the item that you need to ride one of them. So that might actually be worth our while. Or, you know, we just send our little minions down here to obliterate some T-Rexes, some Allosauruses, and some other fun stuff like... I see that little that little brood mother dude. Can we can we take that down? Can we do it? Another tide. Oh, we did. Look at all the loot we just got. Yo! Yes, please. Awesome. That's fantastic. Wait, did I get these levels from the Brontos or from my little minions just now? Either ways, let's go and get some health because I'm sure it'll be well worthwhile in the long run. I'm actually gonna give my dude here a lot of health because I feel like <laughs> I will cry if I end up losing him. I should probably take him back to base to actually get him healed up. Oh, yeah. What loot did we just end up? Oh, organic poison rival version two. I think these are actually stronger. Oh, we finally got it. The Doc's long neck advanced rifle. Oh, I've been waiting for one of these for so long. I guess the spider was the key to getting it. You know what that means? We can finally start using these tranquilizer darts, I think. Oh, that's awesome. And oh, I can use weapons from the back of my RG. So I can just like fly around and, and, and shoot stuff. Oh my gosh, I need to find something to shoot. We got any apexes nearby that kind of like want taming. A griffin, I still do want a griffin. That could be pretty juicy. I thought that was a rock, but nope, that's an apex pithecus prime. Do you think I could kill it? <laughs> oh, manticore, hello. Apex manticore X. Should I send my little dudes to, to fight it? I mean, I, I mean, I, I won't end up in trouble, will I? That's the thing right now. I'm just super cautious. I don't know what will eventuate in my death, and I don't really want to speed up that process. But, like, if I was to just summon him a little dudes, send them to fight the Manticore. Oh, yeah, there we go. We got the whistle in. Like, what will happen to the Manticore? I'm assuming it will just drop dead and die, right? Or not. No, they got it. They got it. They kind of just got wiped out of the process. But dude, he dropped some pretty sweet loot. We got two, four, five, six of the special meats in there. The only thing is, um, I need to find a way of actually getting that. Because obviously I'm I'm up on my RG. And it's a floating backpack in the sky. It didn't even drop. Um, I do have one idea though. If I can sit like right above it, which I, this is looking pretty good. And then just dismount. Oh, I can actually sit on the back of my RG. Oh my gosh, this guy just gets better and better. Okay, that's a bit derpy. Um, basically, what I was thinking was, bit of this action. Hey, is that going to work? Yes, it did. <laughs> Lovely. Awesome. Oh, that's the best. Okay, then. Well, we've taken down one. I assume... Oh, there's a nest. Oh, that's the... Oh, the Manticorp is protecting this nest. Okay, then. I am going to steal its egg. Yeah, why not? Let's get an Apex Manticore egg. Oh my gosh. Oh, it is happening today. Imagine if the Manticore mom just like randomly like appeared right on us and is like, hey, that's my egg. <laughs> Bam, you're dead. That's the thing. I don't really know how strong they are. So we do need to be careful still. We've got an Apex Griffin saddle tier two. Well, that's a ridiculously powerful saddle. 
I think I need a griffin to put it on. So where did that apex griffin go that I was just looking at? Because I think I need to tame it. And now that we've got these this rifle here, um, like I think we can surely, surely I can just fire some shots off, right? And hope for the best. Got him. I got him. I just don't... Oh my gosh, he's fast. All right, this RG wants me as well. RG, mate, I am a far superior version of you. What do you hope to achieve, buddy? <laughs> what do you think was going to happen? I know there's also some, like, yellow darts. I don't know which ones. Oh, these are meta metabolism boost darts. Increases hunger. Okay, so I guess they're good for, like, helping tame stuff up faster or something. That's, that's actually kind of cool. We've got a Dox poison rifle. I can fire these little bullets, I assume. Okay. How much torpor do those deal? They're pretty instant, too. Oh, we're out of bullets. Wait a second. We've got this one here as well. And what's good about this rifle is it slows down your target, I assume, because that's what the version ones do. Does it do more damage than torpor, though? I guess that is the question. Let's see what it's capable of. And hopefully we don't die or anything. Not bad. So we can just keep shooting it, right? All right. I don't want to get hit by it. That... Yeah, I forgot. It does do like a pretty crazy attack. It like shoots a gust of wind out its wings. Yeah, <laughs> I guess. Oh, so it does like a thousand damage. Yeah, we do need this guy. Also, I'm a little bit low on stamina. Probably should have been more prepared here. But all in all, we're getting the better of him. So that's kind of what you want to be seeing. Fortunately, though, we keep using this gun. We're going to kill it eventually. And that, that wouldn't be good. Um. Also, oh, snap. Why can't I see anything? Okay, there we go. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. What am I? What what mode am I in right now? Hold on a second. Oh, I couldn't even control any. Oh wait, hold on. Where are you? Where are you? You there? You there? Yeah, there you are. Okay, I don't want that torpor dropping off, mate. But whatever we're doing is is working, I think. Oh, that deals so much damage. All right, we gotta go. We actually gotta go. He's actually gonna. <gasps> My stamina is shot. Oh no. All right, I'm killing it. I'm killing it. I don't care. It's gotta die. It's gotta die. We'll try again. We'll try again. Oh, he's gonna run away. Nice, perfect. Okay. Woo! I thought he I thought he was gonna have me. I thought he had me there for a second. I feel like I've got more to lose here than gain. And you know, me being me, probably gonna end up losing everything. Which would suck. Big time. Also, I'm flying around with no stamina. Not not ideal. What am I doing? I wonder if I just dismount. Will that recharge your stamina? That does not recharge its stamina. I didn't even think to summon in my minions to protect me there either. What is wrong with me, dude? <gasps> golden Pteranodon? Okay, a lot of golden dinosaur. I'm, I'm not I'm not wasting that opportunity. All right, sorry, Griffin, mate. You're taking a back seat to whatever. But well, look, at least I can catch this thing. All those levels and movement speed are about to pay off, I think. Golden Pteranodon, I have no idea what you are or what you mean, but I, I, I need you. I need to kill you. I'm sure you've got something nice on you that I need. Come back, buddy. I'm going to get you. You can't outrun this. <laughs> Dude, oh, wait. Am I meant to harvest it? Come back here, little guy. Come back here. What do, you, do you have, like, gold for me? You want to give me some gold? Goblin wants his gold. Oh, I forgot. We're, like, in Dragon Valley down here. We do need to be careful because I don't know if I'm ready to be fighting extra dragons and stuff. But anyways, um, look at all the meat we just... Oh, we got health potions. <gasps> Ascend an Apex Dragon Heart and Scale Saddle. That also sounds pretty cool. We also got an Apex Prime B Saddle. But, dude, look. Wow. Okay, golden dinosaurs. Kill them. Kill them as soon as you find them because have a look at all the meat we just ended up with. Oh, that is amazing. But I'm going to use this health. No, not on me. I think that's healing us anyways. Okay, cool. If I use health potions on myself, it also heals my tame, which means it probably pays to have these in my hot bar. Well, now that I've got my health potions, right, I can kind of just... We can just get him really angry and, and just keep on shooting him. And eventually, I'm sure we'll get the tame. So I'm going to do that. <laughs> I'm going to do exactly that. I don't know where he just went. Oh, come on, bro. We're meant to make this easy. Well, we are going to make this easy because he's going to keep doing laps and flying into us, I hope. Why are you sitting behind me? That is like the most inconvenient place you could have sat, mate. All right, where's he going to come from this time? It's like he sits just out of my reach and I need to like turn to find him. You little pest. And then I just miss a shot completely. That's that's terrible. Wait a second. I got a much better idea. No, maybe not. Why don't I just pop a grenade? When he sits right next to me, I'll just pop a grenade right in his face. The thing is, it will knock out my RG as well. And, you know, if my RG falls asleep before the Griffin does, it wouldn't be ideal. <laughs> it would be far from it. <gasps> He's running. He's running. And this time I have stamina, I think. 
Not much of it, but I have some of it. I actually might not be able to catch this guy. Yeah, I can't catch him. He's too quick. He's too speedy. Come here, buddy. I'm running out of darts. And you're going to wake up in a second or so. We are a long way from home. Gotcha. <laughs> All right. I literally need to hit him with like three more darts. Come on. Do not change course. Keep flying straight. Keep. All right. How am I so bad at firing these things? I think I'm moving faster than what the darts move. Yeah, I'm literally missing him. All right. Ugh. Where are you going? No, I told you not to change directions. Oh, you pest. Oh, you potato. What are you? Where are you going? All right, now I'm lost. Yes, he stopped. He stopped. But look how much his doorboard dropped in the process. That's fine. We can go again. We just, you know, need to deal a little bit of extra doorboard now. That's all. All right, like five more darts. And we'll have this guy in our care for more, maybe? Maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe, actually, yeah. Oh, hello. Ha, 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 ha. Okay. Um, that is what we do not want to be running into. Also, I'm out of stamina. Oh my gosh, there is another one. What is with all the titans around the place? All right, either way, this dragon needs to be avoided. That thing will kill me. That thing will 100% destroy the living daylights out of me. The question is, I was going to say, where did our griffin escape to? He's still kicking, which is great. It's exactly what I want to be seeing. I guess this is also why you're meant to trap your griffins instead of just chasing them around the map like we are. This is a very, very not intelligent way of trying to tame one of these guys. But, you know, this is just how it goes, I suppose. I actually got an idea right here, right now. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Come here. Come here. Come here. If I go down, we're all going down, baby. We're all going down together. I don't necessarily know if that works, but my RG's probably... Uh, he's actually doing okay. Why isn't it affecting the griffin, though? Also, I'm really low on health. Yeah, for whatever reason, that's bizarre. The grenade did not affect the griffin. Also, I'm out of ammo. I'm out of darts. So, you know what? Load up the grenades, baby. Oh, now he's running away from me again. Oh, buddy. Buddy, come on. You're not being fun. As if you're making me work so hard for this, buddy. Come on. Is that a third Titan broodmother down there? Because that's getting a little crazy if it is. Oh, that was a really dumb idea. I'm just trying to knock this thing out with grenades in the sky. <laughs> hey, look, desperate times call for desperate measures, I suppose. I don't know what to tell you. Um, but there is no... I'm, if anything, I'm just going to knock my RG out in the sky. Here we go. I'm literally going to pop this one right on me. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Take that one, buddy. You want, you want another one? Come and get it. Come and get it. I'm using myself as bait for this tame. Also, we're out of stamina again. This guy, I think, just drained stamina. Also, I think he might be going down. No, so close again. Okay. My own, like, detriment here is my stamina by the looks of it. We just keep on, well, yeah, stamina-rising ourselves. And it doesn't help that now my torpor is ridiculously high either. I think i've run out of methods to knock him out with you win this time apex griffin you win this time and last time oh wow actually yeah apex griffins are like two and oh against me now oh there's a couple apexes through here so this is normally a forest and the fact it is not currently a forest tells me i think a giant titan broodmother roamed through here or at least a titan something roamed through here <laughs> either ways I'm going to kill these guys and steal all their little goodies. Because that's just one of those things that I can do now. You want to see something quite unsettling? You look to your right, giant spider. <laughs> look to your left, another giant spider. And if you look behind me, probably about there somewhere. We obviously can't see that far, but there is another giant spider. Anyways, we are just going to try our best to ignore the giant spiders. And instead, what I'm going to do is summon in my beautiful little flock of birds. And I'm going to kill this manticore down here. I feel like dining on another manticore egg. So go get him. Go get him, guys. Go destroy him. Go wipe the floor with him. And... Oh, oh, he's putting up a tough fight. Oh, he, he actually won the battle. Oh, hey, Griffin. You're trying to avenge the annoyance that I've caused for your buddy today. Um, wow. 
my minions failed at that one, but that's okay. We'll just have to try again. Or maybe I'll just like sneak in and steal his egg while he's not looking. <laughs> nope. We're going to go again. Go get him, boys. Show me what you can... Oh! Did he do it? No. One shot left. Well, I'm getting in there for it. There we go. <laughs> nice. Wait, did he drop loot for me at least? The other one did. This guy didn't. Oh, what a cheap manticore. Either ways, uh, we can still take its eggs, so that's awesome. I'm just a little concerned about all Apex Dragon over there. Do, 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 do. These raptors are probably going to come and aggress me in a second, so I just want to be ready for them. All right, now I think we're good. We got that, and we're out of here. Egg number two collected, baby. Yeah, but two eggs is not enough. We got to go for the trifecta. And all that stands between us and that is this apex dragon and the giant spider. No, not really the giant spider, but I feel like wherever I look, there's a giant spider in my vision. So just as a bit of context uh, for these apex dragons here, they don't look like much. We've obviously killed a few manticores today. So how strong could a dragon be? Well, last time I played this mod, I angered one of these guys and he chased me around the entire map. I mean, I led this guy on laps around the entire map to try and outrun him, scoop in, steal his egg. And you know what he did? He somehow magically appeared right on his nest and kicked my butt. I think I lost a good five or six teams to one of these guys. So that was a fun time. But anyways, uh, we're, we're going to hope that doesn't happen today because I am going to summon in my little boys and we're going to... Oh gosh, they didn't even get close to it. Mm, they didn't even get close to it. I couldn't even get close to him. Okay. Um, this might be tougher than first thought. Have a look at that. Oh, no, they did. They got like a couple little hits on him. But don't worry. We will be trying this again. Get in there, boys. Finish him off. We've already distracted him from his nest. How are we looking now, though? I just need like five hits. Just, just, wow. 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 He's so strong. He's just too quick with a fire breath, dude. Dude, they didn't even get a hit. They didn't even get a hit that time. What? Do you think if I just went for his nest, he would be aware of it? Or do you think he'd just be oblivious? Because he's, uh, he's, he's, he's kind of heading quite far away from it. Oh, no. He's just seen me. Oh, he just saw me. He just saw me. I got too close to the nest. Oh, he saw who's been sending little minions at him constantly. Yeah, look at him. Oh, he wants it. Oh, he wants me. He's got a taste for chicken tonight. <laughs> see, we'll see, mate. Don't worry. We'll see. I got some minions with your name on them. Go, my friends. Get him. Get him. I think we might. No! Are you serious? Again? We'd be burning up enough chickens to supply a country at this rate. Go, oh, go to Teredodon. How frequent do these golden spawn? I remember these guys being a lot quicker than this guy is. I, I, I'm surprised at how slow he is, to be honest. But... Um, I'm not really interested anymore. I'm, I'm kind of a little bit more interested in the golden pteranodon down there, to be honest with you. <laughs> I do have... I do have something I want to try, though, right? If I whistle my little dudes over in that direction, right? And then I lure the dragon over here, and then I say, go get him from the side. Look at my little dudes. Look at them. No, they still got burnt to a crisp. Oh, no. Yes, one from behind. Get him. Get him! Yes! 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 Oh, we almost outsmarted him there! That was good! That was so good. I'm feeling for my little babies, but he's down to 7,000 health. Should I just swoop in and do it? Let's see what we can do here, hey? We can burn. We're burning, but it's fine. I've got to hit him like three times. Let's finish him off. Oh, he's fast. Why has he got super speed now? It's like he just got like a massive speed boost. Okay, then. <laughs> All right. He's actually... Okay. He's actually... Uh, yep. Yep. Okay. I can't actually get close to him. Oh, he's fast. You were hiding your secret talents all along. Way to play the long con. All right. Yep. Health potions going in. Activation acquired. Let's go. I need to hit him like three times. You know what? I got minions. I got minions for this. This is what my minions are for. Go get him, my minions. Minions. My filet minions. I got to hit him with one more shot. That's it. One more hit. And it's coming straight at his face. Boom! He's still alive. Okay. All right. All right. One more hit. Now it's one more hit. And boom, baby. <laughs> That's what you get. Oh, look at my... What in the world is... Oh, my Archie's a... <laughs> filling this guy with poop. What? 
I mean, okay, sure. I, okay. Oh, hello. <gasps> oh, okay. That's bad. That's, 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 oh, that's a prime RG chasing us. Um, hey, no, 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 no. I just got done dealing with a pretty, okay. Um, that, that is pretty much what we are. That is what that, that RG is. That RG is me. That RG is us. All right. Well, we've lost the RG, so that's great news, which means I can hopefully drop down here, grab myself at last the dragon egg. And we can get our butts out of here. But not before I pay one last visit to the golden pteranodon. <laughs> oh, we already know you're not going to outrun me, buddy. You can try. You can fly, but you ain't going to do it. Thank you very much. Another Apex Griffin saddle along with a ton of more meat. Also, some Manticore Prime enhancement pieces. I can't remember what these are used for, but... I'm sure they're going to come in handy. Oh, what a day it has been. We've got a Broodmother flag we can place down. We also have an Alpha Sarko just down here. Alpha Sarko meets Apex Sarko. Yep, goodbye. So just a little update in the meat department. This is what our current meat supplier looks like. It is beautiful. For some reason that I can't work out, we're just running around like real slow motion too. I'm not way down or anything. I just, I guess we just can't move. But most importantly, there is our trifecta of eggs. And I guess tomorrow, I think we're going to be hatching these guys up.